So if you ever have that urge to get a little more creative, maybe start a business making things rather than working for someone else? A young woman in Collinsville did just that. She started a business with a mission to help animals at the same time. So here is Melissa Cole with her story. And then you want to stir it for usually like three minutes or so. Kelly Holland of Collinsville started a business just about a year ago, hand pouring candles and creating other fun products. She works out of her small apartment with a rather large companion. This is Lady, Lady Lucy, and I've had her for just about three months, rescued her from Texas. And she's a Great Dane. She's a Great Dane. They're like their own their own category of dogs in, in such a special way. They're super sensitive, they're very loyal, they have such great personalities, they, they love big. The name of her business is a nod to her favorite pup. So dang good, it's a little play on words, like so dang good. Um, but obviously Great Danes are a huge part of my life and I also donate a dollar from every item sold to a pet rescue organization. Kelly loves working with her hands and being creative, making everything herself, even the logos. And the salsa clear jars with the black lids, these are my classic scents, and these are just a couple of them. The seaside citrus, that was actually supposed to be a summer special, but people were loving it, and so I, I kept that one going. The black ones, these are my absolute favorite, so I took my three favorite scents and I turned them into a luxury line. So they're the black on black on black, they've got the wooden wicks, um, but there's just three of my most favorite scents. She makes the soaps with oatmeal and shea butter. Positively clean, that one my mom actually came up with because she is super picky about soap scents, and so that one's a mixture of eucalyptus and rainwater. And then my mom actually makes all of the, the sewn products. So she does the scrunchies, the little bandanas, um, bow ties we just started, and then little doggy bag holders that clip right onto your leash. I also do the workshops, so those are super fun. We'll do all sorts of different things, different candles. We'll make little soaps too. We'll do the wooden dough bowls and then top them with different toppings. So those are a lot of fun and I'll do those at local places around, around in the area. Kelly also does custom candles and you'll find some of her items in local shops across the state. Her advice to people who want to take the leap and do something more creative, go for it, she says working with her hands is very rewarding. It's a blast, I really love it. Sometimes I'm sitting there stirring my wax and I'm like, this is my job, this is so nice. <laughs> Oh my God, that dog is so beautiful and so are the products. Yeah, Dane Good. I love the name too, danegood.com. And you can learn more about Kelly's products there as well as the donations to help pets. You can also follow her on Facebook and Instagram. I definitely want that. I didn't realize that was hers, the Apre Sundance. I need yeah, that in cool. my world, yeah. Still